next match is a shoot fight. And our competitors will make their way to the ring now. Let you know the rules of this match. There are five three minute rounds with 30 second breaks between. If this match can only end in a submission or a knockout, if it goes the distance, referee Gordon Pumpernickel will render a decision. What was that again, Pumpernickel? If the match is going to the decision, the decision will be made by myself, Evil Jim, and Commissioner Dean Tapp. All right, there you have it. We're awaiting the entrance of our second competitor. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing the competitors in this special shoot fight here at Adults Fucking Only. In this corner, wearing black and white and weighing in at 260 pounds, a man with an accomplished amateur wrestling background and shoot fighting background, I give to you from Forest Park, Illinois, Johnny! Green peas. And his opponent, wearing white trimmed with orange, weighing in at 185 pounds from Detroit Rock City, a man who says he brings a new attitude into the ring here tonight and has asked that he be introduced as Evil Ash. Referee Gordon Pumpernickel. There will be five three-minute rounds. There will be no striking on the ground. There will be no eye gouging, no hair pulling, no, no scratching, no fish hooks, no low blows. Let's keep it fair. Let's hit this until my fight is done. fight a rivalry that has nothing to do with a work or an angle. These are two men with differences that only could be settled in the ring in a real fight. And that's what we have right here. Greenpeace, obviously, with the size and the power advantage. Ryan Ash will have to stick and move if he has any chance in here tonight. Greenpeace has it pinned down. Wow, Greenpeace using that power. Ash fighting out of the guard, trying to get his hands up in the face of Greenpeace. Comfort him, breaks the wrestle. You can see the intensity in this one. This is not your normal match. Greenpeace backs him into the ropes. He can't have him there. Ash with a knee. Is a 
this one has been basically ground grappling to this point. Not much in the way of strikes. Green Peas, wow, powers into the ground. Ash trying to protect his face as Green Peas washing his face with his forearm. Ash on his back is that's where all of Green Peas' weight is, 80 pounds can be brought to bear, crashing down where Ash Ash able to escape. And now Ash is on Green Peas. I don't know if he has him in a choke. That is legal here in this match. Hey, come on, come on, come on. You can make a man tap out or knock him out. Those are the only two ways that this match can be won. Johnny Green Peas getting this ring alone. Ryan Ash bringing his friends. Jack and Dennis putting a deal and Matt to the ring with him. Hey, stop time. Time stopped as Green Peas' hand back has come loose. You can tell this is not the normal match. These guys aren't trying to work the crowd. They're not trying to tell a story. Everybody, including the onlookers at ringside, intense in this match. Open hand strikes to Green Peace. Green Peace hooks and collar and elbow. He's got him back to the ropes. Green Peace again with the forearm and the elbow. Ash trying to stay on his feet. Left hand by Ash right to the face of Green Peace. And here they go. The intensity has been dialed up. Ash. Ash. 30 seconds left in this round. Ash threw the first punch, and Greenpeace yeah. has answered, and now the strikes are coming full force. Left hand by Ash. He's trying to stick and move. Greenpeace, oh man, what a throw, as he sends Ash to the mat. 10 seconds left. Hold on, dude. The first round coming to a close. Pumpernickel waiting for the signal. And you hear the bell, and that's the end of round one. Ladies and gentlemen, that is the end of round one. There will now be a 30-second break before round two. Round two. Ash. Left hands, right hands. It's the boxer against the wrestler right now. Ash trying to strike with his hands. Green his knees, keep Green Peace off of Green Peace. He's as strong as a damn bear. And once he grabs hold, it's over for Ash. And he just crashed Ash to the mat. Ash tried to kick He caught the leg and dumped him on the canvas. Pumpernickel. Intently looking on. This is the kind of match where someone can get seriously injured. You don't have to keep a close eye on these two. Green Peace. Top of Ash, the crowd, getting behind Ryan Ash as Greenpeace squeezes him down. Wrenching his neck. You can hear Ash screaming to get out of that move, and he's in the ropes. He has to break. Ryan Ash in trouble here as Greenpeace has it on the ground and is wearing him out. Ash trying to strike ground with those left hands. Jab and right and right. Ash with a boxing back. Greenpeace with a wrestling back. Ash's punches while having some effect did not back Greenpeace off. Dear God, no! What a throw by Johnny Greenpeace. Greenpeace on top. Ash, obviously, you can hear him screaming all the way over here as he tries to power out. Greenpeace is in the ropes as Ash gains the upper hand. Nick again has to break. No striking while on the ground, but Greenpeace has been very effective with those elbows and forearms, rubbing them against the face and chin of Ryan Ash, which is just as good as any striking. Oh, forearm to the face. Wow. 30 seconds left in this round. Greenpeace hammering Ash. I mean, he looks like he might be fish hooking in there. Ash trying to break his arm in an armbar maneuver, and now they're tied up in the ropes. Pumpernickel looking for the break. The round coming to a close. 10 
seconds left. Ash rolls out, green piece. Wow, he's got him wrenched with that arm, but green piece, very accomplished. Rolls through, and that is the end of the round. That is the end. All technical difficulties on the house mic. Round two has come to a close. Again. Ash back up for round three. Green Peaks disrobing. Ash showing off his slim physique, but I tell you what, Green Peaks is powerful, personified, and has controlled this match with that strength advantage. Green Peaks takes him straight down. Ash in the guard again. Ash dropped to protect like himself. Grudge shoot fight. Ryan Ash, a good showing, but Greenpeace lets him know that in the end he tapped out. <laughs>